Brian Larson. Um, this is a Lincoln Long Wool. We call our place the Larson Lincoln Long Wools. And we breed uh, more traditional Lincolns that keep the traditional breed character. They're very sturdy. They have a lot of body capacity. We call them high volume sheep. They have uh, big rumens, uh, big bodies. They're lots of bone. They're very rugged and a beautiful fleece. Their fleece is kind of the uniqueness, and they're also very useful uh, as uh, market animals. They're very muscular, have very strong loins, very wide loins, so they make a very market acceptable product. The Lincolns, as I have mentioned, come in the traditional white fleeces, and they also come in a colored fleece, which we call natural colored. As you can see, this fleece has a number of different shades, which is very common in the link colored Lincoln, where you'll have silver and gray and even almost brown and sometimes even black in one fleece. So that makes a very interesting product to work with, especially for the spinners. The white fleece is so nice because it takes the color that you want it to have as far as the dyeing process. And notice, uh, you can see in the white fleece more distinctively the, the crimp and the lock shape of the Lincoln fleece. And you can see these locks are um, well formed. They're probably about a 10 to 12 inches long. This is about a 10 month fleece and has beautiful luster in it and uh, you can see the crimp is very bold and the fiber is extremely strong so you use this fiber in something that you want strength in a product uh, if you're interested in getting involved with the lincolns you have to remember that these are big sheep uh, they're big sheep for a purpose because they make a very good economic package to work with and a lot of wool uh, they're very good natured, fortunately, and, uh, but you do have to remember that they're large and you have to be ready to handle them. Uh, they're very easy, easy keepers. In other words, uh, they don't need a lot of grain. They're really developed for grass. Uh, lambing time is, is very uh, stressful time, but it's not so stressful for the sheep as it is for the shepherd. Uh, the Lincolns tend to have uh, very long, narrow lambs when they're born, and it's rarely that you have to help. Uh, sometimes when I'm there, I do help just because I'm there. We do have a, the National Lincoln Sheep Breeders Association. It's a rather small group, but it's a very friendly group. And there's a lot of people that serve as mentors to new breeders. Um, the, the value in, in being a member is that you uh, can access those breeders easier and they, they can keep good, good information flowing to you as far as advice and raising them.